it's Betsy from Cutting Corners Vinyl in Nederland, Texas, and today we have a fun video. We're going to be doing another Hobby Lobby Dollar Tree haul. Now, there are a couple of things I think in here from Target, but it's mainly Hobby Lobby and Dollar Tree. Now, I went shopping because I needed some supplies and I found some good stuff. So, first up from Hobby Lobby. I picked up, this is one of the things from their spring section. So it originally retails for $5.99, but y'all know how Hobby Lobby works. So this was 40% off, and I don't know what I wanna do with it yet, but isn't that super cute? Like I know I wanna paint it, I don't know if I, what I wanna make with it though. But I really, really like this. I think that is super duper adorable. It's like rain boots with flowers. Then we have a Dollar Tree bag, and I grabbed, a bunch, and you're, I'm sure we'll see more of these, of the glittered Easter eggs. And there's 10 of them to a pack. But I like that they are they have a really good glitter coat on them. So I was excited for those, and they're really pretty. So I got those. I found these in the garden section. These are like some uh, dragonflies that have like the little metal hook on the back to twist in. But I thought these were super cute. I'm really into springtime stuff right now. So I was like, yay. I found the little wooden foam shapes and this is like a dinosaur design. So that would be like a Brachiosaurus or a Brontosaurus. So that's what that looks like. And there's 10 of those for a dollar. Cameron actually picked those because he loves dinosaurs. So I got another set of the little purple dragonflies and then they also had some double sided tape. So this has sticky on both sides of it. And I grabbed that, that again was a dollar. This is acid free and archival. So you can use this with scrapbooking, which to me seemed like a good deal because scrapbooking stuff can be expensive. Next up, we grabbed, this is the Wood Shop 3D wood puzzle. And this is a flamingo. I don't know what we're gonna do with it yet, but I love flamingos. Isn't that cute? So we're gonna put that together, use it in an upcoming project. Again, it was a dollar. I grabbed some Easter towels. Aren't those cute? Look how retro these look. Like I love, you see how it's got, that's like more of that Astro-y kind of design. To me, these are scream very 60s. And I love the colors, like the teal and the purple and the pink. Everything about that just screams happiness to me. So I got some of those. And then Cameron got me to get a bunch of the, those big lollipops, love those things. So I have a bunch of those, I need to bring those home. Oh, don't put it over the fire. I have a candle going over next to me. <laughs> don't wanna burn my shop down. From Hobby Lobby, I picked up one of the, this is the craft foam. So it's just a wreath ring because I do plan on doing something. Now, I don't know if you know this, but Hobby Lobby did stock their coupons nationwide. So whenever I'm buying stuff from Hobby Lobby, for the most part, I try to buy things when they are on 50% off or 40% off because Hobby Lobby does do rotating sales. So I got another one of the little flower boots because I typically buy doubles in case I mess anything up. So I end up with a lot of projects left over. But I think I'm fixing to try to do some reorganization in my office to be able to store all these. And then I got two pineapples. Those darn things are sharp. But aren't those cute? Like, I want to glitter this. I want to glitter this. I think that's what I'm going to do. I don't know. But I ordered some of, like, the paper umbrellas. Like, the little drink umbrellas from Amazon. So maybe I'll throw those together. I don't know. So more of the glitter eggs, that's two more packs. I think I bought six packs of those all together. I could be wrong though. I have a bunch of stuff. I spent $100 at Dollar Tree. So that's a lot for dollar items. I got some more of the dragonflies. These were some magenta ones. They only had the purple and the magenta and they had two purple and only one magenta. So, I also got these headbands. They have, these, they have a better Dollar Tree that's in Bridge City local to us. So, I got these headbands that have like these little rabbits on them. So, they kind of remind me of Peeps and then they have the little tails on them. So, I bought two of each. I want to make an Easter wreath and I don't know if I'll have time to make it this year before. But, it was like, well, we'll go ahead and grab these. So, 
we got six of those because like you can take and cut these off from here and then you'll have like already sewn little fuzzy bunnies okay um they had this ribbon at dollar tree so as you can see it's uh like that burlap with like red screen print dots i thought that was cute in their craft section they had this little scotty dog again like part of what i do and i know this sounds crazy it's like i'll buy a bunch of stuff and then whenever things come around for me to make with it i have a lot of things here so i can add to which i think is a good like if you're doing any type of crafting to kind of get a bunch of stuff together so that way it kind of helps spark ideas i think is super important so i got four of these like picture frames they look like this and they say this is us now this does come out of here i don't know if i can pull that off but i was like well one you could almost glue these together and make like a really cute tall sign i don't know yet but i got them because that was such an unusual shape and size. And again, for a dollar, you can't beat that. And the frame is wood. Then, let's grab another bag. So, we've got... I grabbed this little set of shapes. So, as you can see, these to me are a more springtime shape. So, there's six wood cutouts in there. So, there's like the ladybug, the owl, and the butterfly. So, we got those. I got some of the big clothes pins. Um, I got two packs of those. Clothes pins again are good for crafts. Um, I grabbed some of the little triangles. These are like makeup sponges, but I bought them to do nails because that's one of the cheapest places to get it. And then at my Dollar Tree, they had these. These are glitter glue sticks, like little tiny glitter glue sticks aren't they cute so i bought several packs of those i don't know what i'm going to use them for but for a dollar it's like well we'll grab some while they have them because i don't know you know the dollar tree does tend to change things quite a bit and then i found these two cute clip-on succulents again i don't know if i'm going to use them for a wreath or what but they have like the clip on the back of them they're nicely made and for the most part they look pretty realistic so i was like yeah we'll do those so i got two of those and then again from the crafter square section this is the embossing tool so i'm going to use this for nails so it's, as you can see it's got a little tea tiny dot on that side and one over on this side so you can create like flowers and stuff on your fingernails so i bought actually two of those one for crafting and one for nails Let's grab this big O bag. Okay, so Cameron loves, loves, loves candles. Loves candles. Well, we typically buy candles at whenever they're on sale. Well, right now there's not a sale going on, so he picks some candles. So we've got, and these smell pretty good. So we got lavender. Kind of smells more menthol-y. I didn't pick that one, but yeah, that does smell like menthol more than lavender. Then we got sun ripened berry. Now that does smell like berry. We got apple cinnamon, which is definitely a fall scent. That is definitely a fall scent, but it does smell good. Um, a what is this? Fresh linen. Now that does smell like I love fresh clean laundry scents. Another apple cinnamon and a, a vanilla. And that does smell like vanilla. Kind of smells like baby vanilla. Like what you would, like if you smell vanilla and like baby wipes, it kind of reminds me of that. And then another one of the berries. We also got, this is another one of the embossing tools. So that one I'm gonna use here for crafts. I also grabbed some of the natural jute rope from the crafters section i grabbed this oh these are some more of the ribbons i got so i got red black and white and like the chevron print and then i got some black dots they didn't have white dots so i got two colors and everything except for the white dots now from hobby lobby i did buy 
one of the little mini glue guns. So this is, so this holds those little glue sticks. And I think this was like, yeah, eight bucks, nothing much. So I was excited to get that. Then from Target, I don't know if both of them are in here or not. Yeah, they both are. The only thing I've really bought from Target for crafting were I bought these two picture frames. These were $5 each. And they have a new section of craft stuff by Mondo Llama. So, and what's nice about these is you can either hang them or you can set them out. But these were cute. So we grabbed those. Now we have some more stuff. So, more eggs. I told you, I bought a lot of freaking eggs. But you never know what you're gonna need eggs for. More glue stick. I bought some of these chalkboard frames. And then this is another set of the die cutouts. So this is the African animals. So we have an elephant, a lion, and a gorilla. So I got a few of the little chalkboards. Then, from their scrapbook section, they had these stickers. Man, I thought these were super cute, these butterflies, and I bought three packs of them. And they're like three-dimensional butterflies. So I don't know what I'm gonna do with them, but they're super cute. And there's four different stickers in here per pack. So, and I love these kinds of colors. So we got those. And then, they had some reusable bags that were a dollar. So, look how cute that is. Like, I don't know what I want to do with that yet, but I might cut it out and like glue it to a palette. I don't know. So we got that. We put, Cameron picked out one that has dinosaurs. So this is Jurassic World from their new one, Camp Cretaceous. And then they already had a Raya of the Last Dragon and it says Stronger Together. Isn't that cute? So we got that. We like that. Then, I found this super cute little Easter sign. Isn't that adorable? A dollar. A dollar. Again, and even if I take it apart, I mean, the materials, I couldn't make that for that cheap. So, I really think that's cute. Then, I got this one. And this I did plan on taking apart. Like I wanna kinda of take these eggs off and cut them off and glue them to something else. I'm, as I said, I'm thinking I'm gonna make an Easter wreath. So I grabbed that. I grabbed multiples of that, which I'm sure you'll see. And one of the things I'm learning to do more of when playing with like more crafting stuff and not just vinyl is dismantling things and using pieces because like I found these at the Dollar Tree and about three of them they're plant hooks so we've got this one with this really pretty purple butterfly on here love that then we've got one that has this blue and like green yellow one and then the orange one well I bought at Hobby Lobby something similar to this and they were like three dollars each before well if i take them off of here then i've got the butterflies by themselves and i don't have to use the hooks i can use the hooks for another project but yeah i thought that was a good deal also from hobby lobby i purchased some tool because it's 50 percent off so i bought some colors to do for an easter wreath possibly so i bought a big roll of white so this was five dollars for that then we've got some glittery, this color, what color do they call this one? Do they, does it say on here? It doesn't say, but like, see, it's like a limey green. And then I got this one, which is more like a robin's egg blue. See how pretty those look together? And then I grabbed this lavender one. So, you can kind of imagine those four colors together. Definitely scream spring. And I have lots of tool too. I try to collect it as I find it. And then from their spring section, this ribbon, look how cute that is. So it's like a leopard print, but it's on pink. And then because I love pineapples, pineapples. And again, these were 40% off. And then I also got these in their spring section. Look at these carrots. Aren't those freaking cute? I love these. 
So, bought those. And then last but not least, from Dollar Tree. I have a big box sitting over here. As I said, I bought a few of the eggs. So you can see that they're different. I bought two of each. So we've got some bunnies in here too. And some chicks. So you can kind of see how cute those are. Aren't they adorable? And you can dismantle these and use these for so many different things. So I am excited by what I got. Are you excited? What are you most excited to see? Because the thing is, with all these things, I can play with it, I can use vinyl with it, I can paint with it, so much fun. So, if you like this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button right down below. And if you hit the notification bell icon next to it, that will notify you when I post new videos, which is typically Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. But I guess that's it, so we'll see y'all later. Bye.